My name is James. I'm the CEO of a small life insurance company. Business was booming until they came. They've literally eaten up all of our clientele. After the zombie apocalypse, my employees and I sought refuge here in my house where we continue to fight to preserve human society by keeping the business alive. Who's with me? Who's willing to go out and bring back supplies? Evan, you are. What? You're a runner, you can outrun anything. You're in for sure. Wait, what makes you think I can outrun anything? Well, you have that picture of you on your desk at the marathon with the medal around your neck? No, 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 that picture's of me at a 5K fun run. Everyone got a medal. Yeah, that's good enough, you're going. That's the spirit, Evan. Now, who else? <laughs> um, thank you for your courage, Natalie, but I think it would be better if you stay here. No, I'm serious, I can help. Again, thank you, but I'd rather have you here. You know what? Don't give me that bill. And you better not tell me it's because I'm a woman. Don't make me report you to HR again. HR is dead. Didn't you notice? That little twit never made it to his car. Shut up, Bill. That little twit was my friend, and he's a good man. He was a man. You know what, are you serious? I just killed a zombie with this bat. That's his body on the floor, and that's his blood on the wall for crying out loud. Come on, Bill. Okay. For the last time, they are not zombies. Zombies do not exist. Well, what are they then? Why can't we just wait this out? Why can't we just stay here where it's safe instead of going outside and risking our lives? That's not a bad idea, Bill. I mean, guys, we have so much work we need to get done. I don't know if we can afford to get sidetracked here. Good morning, Tina. Good morning, James. Hey, James. Yeah? How'd the meeting go? It went great. We actually got the client. Uh, it's a commercial account, and they have over 100 employees. That's fantastic news. Well done. Yeah. Oh, by the way, um, will you set up a meeting to sign paperwork tomorrow morning at 11 AM? Yeah, of course. Let me just check your calendar. No problem, I've got it booked in for you. Perfect, thanks. Does that have monkeys on it? Love me like this, oh no other way. Oh. Hey, congratulations, James. You're on a roll. Well, thank you guys. I feel like nothing can stop us now, but we can't celebrate too much. More clients means more work. And what's coming is going to be killer. But this is your moment. You gotta take some time to just enjoy it. Are you serious, Reed? We've got to keep working. We can't afford to get behind. Can you imagine what would happen if even a few client claims came in at the same time? We have to get supplies. I don't understand how none of you can see the importance here. If we don't have food, we can't live. And if we wait too long, there won't be food to get. If we don't go now, we die. Get it? Die. Okay, okay, Bill. If you feel that strongly about it, then let me get you something. Don't go anywhere. Stay right here. Have you guys ever used one of these before? That's a Glock. It holds 10 rounds. Evan, you load it like this, cock it, and pull the trigger. Got it? I guess so. Good. I hope this works. Oh, Brooke, I'll be fine. I'll do this. I'll save us. Dang you, Bill. Ready, Evan? I guess so. Good. I still don't think you should do this. Yeah, come on, guys. It's dangerous out there. You are just a bunch of frightened little people. We'll be back. We will get food, and you will live. Get it? You can't do anything without me. I'm the only one making good decisions around here.